Hello comic creators. So today I'm going to show you guys real quick how to set videos to private and what the differences are. So let's say you were uploading a video here. So right off the bat in your upload section, go ahead and select and drag a video in to be uploaded. I'm also going to show you guys um, how to do that with videos that you already have created as well. So don't worry about that. But this is just the basics of when you're clicking a video to upload, how to do that. All right, so once you've selected the file, you're gonna be taken to the page where it allows you to edit a bunch of different things for your video as it's uploading. I did a video walking through all of the different things you can do here, if I, that link is down below if you need to see that. But in this, you're gonna to go to visibility, and then here is your settings for visibility. So you've got private, unlisted, and public. So private, if you click share privately, will only allow you to enter in uh, the specific people that you want to be able to have access to this video. So um, for me here, I'm typing in uh, email addresses. If you use email addresses, um, and they're, they, you have to make sure that they're tied to uh, the YouTube channel, or they're going to have to access it or enter in their email address uh, when they go in to watch it. So just remember that. So if it's like a Yahoo account or something like this, they have to enter it and then you can click notify by email. So it sends them the link directly. Now, what that is is only people that you put in that section for private will be able to access that video, no one else. It won't be listed on your channel, it won't be in search. Um, even if they share it with somebody else, they won't be able to see it. Now to do this on an existing video, just from your dashboard, go into your videos, click uh, details, and then you want to go down to where it says public right there um, and on an existing video that's already uploaded you click that drop down menu and that's where you can sh sh uh, set to private and add in the people you want to only be able to see it or unlisted or public so and let me show you the difference here between unlisted and private so obviously private is where only people that you specifically identify can see it and unlisted is where only people with the uh, link uh, to the video will be able to share it and the link is the actual URL that you have here so when you click that unlisted only people that have access to this YouTube link which is right here that's the link to the video you can click copy and you can text that to people you can email it to people only people with that link will be able to see it now the difference is is that with unlisted if those people share that link anyone with the link can see it anyone that has the link will be able to view the video with private, only the people that you identify are able to see it. So even if even if the people you identify on private share your video, irregardless, the other people they share it with won't be able to view it unless you give them permission. Whereas with unlisted, anyone with the link will be able to view it. So just keep that keep keep that aware or keep aware of that. Sorry, I can't even talk. That is the difference between the two. Um, and so whenever I'm uh, testing videos or showing videos, you know, kind of running tests and running it through all the people that I s suggest watch it, I always use Unlisted because I don't mind who they share it with. But if there is something that's really private and personal, I make sure I do private because only the people I identify will be able to see it. Guys, I hope that this helped you. If this did help you here in this new year, 2020, going into 2021, please take a second to like com and comment on the video and even subscribe. Uh, it helps with the algorithm. It helps uh, with uh, getting my videos noticed. And let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. I will talk to you guys later.